Next question. Coming up. <laughs> Next question. Really interesting question. So stick to the end. Uh, stick, stick the finger. Stick the finger to the end. I will start with the question of what is flash event? No, you answer. I, I don't have answers. Answers. So what is flash event? Flash event is an event where we have flashes ready. And it's, it's usually a flashes that we like to do or we would like to do or maybe it's some leftover flashes from back in the mm. days and we offer a free, sweet sweet deal on them and people usually love it and they come in and it's usually like very busy and it's really fun till around four o'clock and then it gets very hard because <laughs> you you're kind of getting tired but it's really great event to do the stuff you want to do and for customers it's you can either get a tattoo for a sweet deal so let's say if it's a money issue or something or if you want a tattoo but you don't know what to get then you can come in and see if something is your kind of thing you can get that stuff done and it's also like the way we did it we kind of did ex like you couldn't choose an artist it was also interesting to try other people's styles other people's designs so it was it was interesting we had like in in latvia we had flash event and it was the first yeah, like on that first, kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, and, and uh, so many people came. We were actually shocked uh, that it works so well, and no bullshit, man. People came in, picked this stuff. Everything was old school. Slightly different styles because we are a little different. Uh, handwriting, different handwriting. Yeah, it's like yeah, you could feel it, but but they all were classy, old school designs. And man, like every, every each tattoo was so perfect. We basically made, I can't remember, 40 or 30 something tattoos. I think it was 40 something. Yeah, in eight hours, uh, palm size, beautiful tattoos. And it was like, it was a special day for Latvian people. I know the same shop <laughs> had a sort of flash event on like something like two for one or it was good price on like valentine's day i think it was what one of the first years they worked but then they had also all that crap that we get here the main like disappointment was you put out designs and you say this is the designs we want to do and we give them sweet price because mm -hmm. we want to do them and then just people can i change this about it can i have this why don't you have design like this why don't you have design i want it and you're yeah, like yeah can you take out like, this piece yeah like i'll send in some completely different design it's like why don't you have designs like this mm. i would so love to take it it's like motherfucker because this is my shit <laughs> <laughs> this is why it's good price because i want to do yeah, it yeah 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 uh, man, yes. But yeah, it was just, I was surprised how many people are trying to sneak in their ways. They're like, oh, it would be awesome if you would have. We had that thing. More birds with the fucking my name on them. We had some people who were like, I mean, that's uh, that's how it is, but uh, some people. Did you have that in Latvia like, as well? Yeah, we, we, were, we had some people who just tried to get to the artist they wanted, and then they wanted to change a little designs and choose the fucking hand to do one guy did it oh man it was like crazy he basically lied to the manager to get in and then he got in and suddenly he said i want him to do, i want you to do the devil's head <laughs> tricky motherfuckers everywhere yeah fucking two hours in a flash of it. <laughs> i know some, no one and a half i think some shops they even say like oh, uh, no tricky placements like necks and all that shit yeah. so you don't get... Uh, I'm, I think next time we're gonna try smaller designs, but uh, it's still on, it on was... our first event here. We also put like just kind of printed out them too big the flashes, and it seems fun. But when you start to do it, and you're like, oh, this takes forever. <laughs> yeah, but still, it was fun. Yeah, the yeah. first first flash event I went home at four at night. Like there were people. I was like. Oh, maybe you want to go home. I was trying to like, maybe I can do it tomorrow because it was so late. They're like, no, we came from Copenhagen, so we have to. I was like, 
okay oh, so let's man. do it and then like i was coming home and i saw sunrise when i was back <laughs> oh shit fuck i remember when when i did it here in denmark ah uh, yeah in denmark in a flash event yeah it was so hard <laughs> <laughs> then next morning I woke up, my eyeballs were fucking but swollen. We did like in 12 hours, like fucking 114 or 120 something. It was like ridiculous amount of... It was insane. It, 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 fuck. Quoi. Le the, quoi. <laughs> le quoi. It was le quoi, basically. I wouldn't recommend anyone to do that at home. You're gonna suffer big injuries uh, during the day. Exactly. So ch- chill, the f- chill them, chill them, do hua. And it's been so. How did nothing new. how did public reacted to that? They, everyone liked it. I think there were a couple of people left left out. Right? You couldn't serve everyone. Yeah, we couldn't serve any, everyone because it was too too. It was hard for manager to figure out how much time we need to finish tattoos. Because sometimes uh, one guy comes with two tattoos. He wants two tattoos on himself. So we decided maybe next time just one tattoo each person. No no two tattoos. (gasps) So next time. So there will be next time. Yeah, I guess so. Woo! It's like that. It was everyone was happy, man. Latvia. Countries. I think the next step would be fucking cool to invite people, cool dudes, one or two next time. But I mean, the space. But that would be a good shit to do, right? So Latvia and countries around, keep your buttholes clinched and eyes open. There will be another flash event. Plus, you can get, how much was the price? Like 40, 40 or 50 euros? 40. For palm size? It's so, but one like like you not can, that we're not gonna do that often because it's uh, not fair. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah, it's, it's just, but but that's why but, you have to yeah keep those things open and clinched. Something from time to time you get the chance. It when, would work out to go from it's from Copenhagen, fly to fucking Latvia, get a tattoo, have a dinner, and fly back, and you still man. win. Dude, I was surprised there were people who were coming to get their first tattoos. Like four or something, at least. And I was like, wow, that's crazy. It's And they get fucking old school pieces. Like but some people, random people. When I was sharing that event, I said, you can't go wrong with Riga's Tinta, so... Yeah. They came in, they... It's... Um, man seriously but also i think it's a it's kind of event that it happens everywhere on the planet well at least like in many places yeah it's normal and it was like first time in latvia and it was kind of cool to introduce that kind of way of looking at tattoo and getting tattoo done yeah super awesome good education <laughs> you know a lot if a lot of people come and get that old school design they come home and they see actually how it looks in real life and then the the their taste will change a little bit tiny bit never stop learning in conclusion the difference between latvia and central europe is not that big but latvia is still learning yeah they're they're getting there that many good tours compare comparing to how big is the country yeah, like many on, uh, really good fucking tattoos. On that Latvian tattoo movie, there was one tattooist said she was like, "If you get a bad tattoo in Latvia, you're like, it's interesting. You're like, okay, <laughs> you where did you? It. Yeah, where, how did you <laughs> fail at finding tattooist? Because like, yeah, true, man, uh, really, really cool. We had this meeting with all other tattooers, and it was great to meet them all, talented people. So there's more than three tattooists in there? A lot of them. Go on Google, type in Latvia tattoo, Riga tattoo, and see what's there. Yeah, check there is... check that country out. It's a, a cheap, cheap tattoos. You can fly there and get it's some. A good quality. Good... Oh my god, we're gonna fucking good quality, destroy good the price. tattoo this industry. Is Latvia. Man. <laughs>
Uh, back back in the days, people were going there to get drunk and f ladies. Now, now it's time to get tattoos. <laughs> no, probably not. No, but do, do research. Do your but research. But a lot of people does that already. I heard about it. But uh, they do everywhere. They yeah. fly. If you are ready to pay for the flight ticket and tattoo, I think you can also be ready for flying somewhere else and get tattoo from. Yeah, enjoy the culture, see the cities. So, <laughs> enough for this bullshit? Yeah, I need to pee. pee. Okay, bye-bye! <laughs>